Alrighty, let's play this in full. There's sound. No! Breaking the rules doesn't make you a hero. It makes you a screw-up. Take it from me, Luke. One out of a million dropouts become Steve Jobs. Do you know who become losers with no jobs? The other 99,000! No. <laughs> Alright. Cool stuff here. Let me bring down the volume a tad. I think this works a lot better. I think the only thing I would say is... It's potentially a way to do less of that just because we have it again here it's kind of a repeat you know there's a slight change in the wrist orientation but i do like this a lot she goes from here i love that it's the hand turn that leads into that turn here and that's still the only thing i would say here is this gesture moving back of this arm it feels a bit mechanical it's a bit straight like there's no arc but it just it just feels like she's kind of retreating as if someone's pulling her back and you got this arm and this arm pulling back at the same time just anything you can do i mean what is she doing afterwards she can do this so what if she does maybe you can have a little bit of energy there one of a million with a little bit of up and down so that this will have a little bit of wing wing wing. So it's a bit more a bit more activity there. And then on the way back, she she can just lower it and bring that arm down to the sides. This just kind of goes down. The thing can lump down here. And then and then you go up for into this. Do you know what it becomes? And then you have that and then that. And <laughs> I still love this. It's great. So that would be, I don't know if you want to go, I don't think it would be a nice silhouette to go down and go play with the color silhouette. I mean, just my main concern is that you have this gesture and then it's kind of the same-ish here. I mean, could it be something where, throwing it out there, uh, open up the hand more towards us, fingers can still be somewhat together, maybe a bit bit uh, spread out and then no, I don't know. It's just a bit more of a getting into a fist. The tension, it's like, ah, no, versus no. Like uh, like we talked about acting at war, it's like, no. And then she can lower the arm into back here, and then it ends up around here. And then you can do that. Man, that feels like that might be just a bit more. So we, we focus right at the very beginning just on her face, and it's not immediately a gesture. <clears throat> the only other thing I would say, as much as I love all this, especially the end here, there's an overall feeling where her steps just feel so... I don't know, they feel kind of so small and... It's hard to describe. I don't mind these. This has a good rhythm. Pop, 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 into this. But then it just becomes kind of just shuffly. She just kind of shuffles. Pop, pop, pop. And then... Like, I don't mind these. So it might just be this. And I think probably what I'm reacting to is that they all kind of feel the same. Kind of shuffle, 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 shuffle. <laughs> but but I, I like the rhythm there. And so maybe it could be something. I mean, you got to get into that pose here. <clears throat> Sorry, that was a little ping ding in there. Where maybe, because I'm also reacting to just the legs there. I don't mind the way they are here, <clears throat> but what could be, <clears throat> excuse me, could be something where that is more of a step forward. It could almost be something, what if you extend her legs a bit more and only at the end, like here-ish, you start to bend the knee. So that when she does this, <clears throat> it's more of a step forward so that you have a, a straighter leg. And imagine that will be straighter as well. So you get more of a, a uh, triangle in terms of the strong feeling there and maybe that might not be as bent over because you're bending over here so what if you go from this to a bigger step a bit more extended root could be a bit higher a bit more towering over there over over the character and then the throw brings her body down into this for that so it's like a, it's a gradual lowering into what you have 
So that way, take a little bit out of the shuffle there. And this one is probably the biggest one. Could that be? It feels like she has there are chains there. She can barely walk. This could be something where could you just take a a a, a bigger step? Boom, like just one, two. Can just make like one long step and then the other step to get into this pose. I'm just curious. I know it's a pain to rework this, but that's the main thing that I have here in terms of um, just me reacting to uh, the steps. So that is, of course, very subjective. Let me know what you think. Other than that, I think it's really working well. I'll still love the ending. Um, so yeah, let me know. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.